everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a lovely day. For today's video, I'm sticking with the makeup challenge theme because last week I did the full face makeup using only one brush challenge. So this week I'm doing the full face makeup using only my fingers and hands. It sounds really weird to say. Challenge, so I'm not using any brushes, just my two hands. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, let's get straight into the video. <laughs> I'm so weird. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go straight in with the Rimmel London Lasting Finish Primer. Um, I can't actually find my other primer, but I used to love this primer so much, so I'm just gonna go in with this one. And pop a little bit onto my hand. Okay, I said a little bit, and then, yeah. Great. I'm just gonna dot this. So my mirror's over here, just in case you're wondering why I'm looking over, why I won't. Looking over there, I'm just gonna dot this all over my face. I used way too much. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm just gonna uh, rub in with one hand. I'm waiting for the primer to set. I'm gonna go in with my concealer, which is the Lasting Perfection Ultimate Wear Concealer by Collection. I'm just gonna use the applicator to put a little bit of this on the back of my hand. I'm just gonna apply this to my eyelids just for a bit of priming and to my flawless natural basic eyeshadow and highlighting palette and i'm just gonna grab the shade latte which is this one right there that's a nice shade to set the concealer with i'm just gonna apply that onto my eyelid I just want to clarify that I'm not a makeup artist and I don't claim to be good at makeup because I'm not. I just kind of like playing around with it, um, making videos, but I don't know what I'm doing. Just okay. I'm gonna grab the shade Stone, which is the second, the second, which is the second shade beside Latte. That one there. I'm gonna attempt to put this like just here. Um, fingers are already dirty. Um. I'm gonna try and just lightly pat put this onto the outer bit of my eye. I'll just use the palette actually, this isn't. The W7 in the Buff Natural Nudes palette. I like have had this for years, but I've forgotten about it and I love it so much. And it just looks like this. And I'm just gonna grab I'm gonna stop saying that word. I'm just gonna take um, the shade apparently. I don't know why that took me so long. Sorry. I'm just gonna take my middle finger and apply this all over my lid. This is very hard to show you. <laughs> oh, no, nope, shouldn't have done that. Eyes are done. There's just a little bit of fallout right there. Um, I'm gonna use my foundation. So the foundation I use all the time is the Bourjois Healthy Max Serum Foundation and I just really like this foundation a lot. I'm just gonna pour it a couple of pumps onto the back of my hand. I'm gonna dot this all over my face. I haven't done my foundation with my fingers in a long time. I used to do it for years before I bought like brushes. Well, not years, I haven't been doing makeup that long, but a long time before I bought brush before I bought bought brushes and I thought it was quite effective. I don't know. I haven't done it since, so let's give this a go. Do I pat it? <laughs> One more layer. It's 
so I don't know if you can see that very well but it looks quite I feel like it's it's definitely more natural than when I put it on with a with a brush but it's quite streaky but I'm gonna leave that <laughs> I'm gonna jump right back into my collection lasting perfection and like a little bit on the back of my hand again pop this underneath my eye which has been my which love. I think the powder I've decided to use today is the number seven uh, perfect light pressed powder powder right here and I'm just gonna set underneath my eyes first for this whole a little bit of this underneath my eyes and the other eye I'm going to attempt to set the rest of my face with this and then patting it in. I'm going to go on to oops, my eyebrows and I couldn't find my little Rimmel um, brow this way so I'm going to go back into my W7 brow powder. I haven't used powders in a long time. I more so use my Benefit Oof Brow or Precisely Brow. Um, but yeah, this looks pretty grubby, but I'm going to be using this shade right here. Does that have a name? I don't think so. Just this shade. It's right here. I'm kind of scared to use this, not going to lie. Um, use my ring finger. No, not my ring finger. This finger. Yeah. Luckily, I have big eyebrows, so this shouldn't be too much of a problem. Uh, my Rimmel London Kate Moss sculpting kit thing. I'm gonna do the same thing, getting the this shade here and get a little bit of that on my hand. And this is the L'Oreal Paris Le Blush in the shade Rose Sandflower. I'm just gonna get this finger and another product and just kind of take some off. I'm gonna go on to my favourite part of makeup, which is highlight. I'm gonna use the two shades I always use, which are these shades here. The Flawless palette is the shade Chase Champagne and Platinum. I'm going to take this on my middle finger and I'm just going to apply this onto my cheek. to apply uh, mascara with my fingers. I'm going to do that off camera and I'll be right back. This stick I'm using the L'Oreal Paris um, 640 in the shade Erotic. Yeah. Oh my god. Um, might be having a little bit of a problem here. <laughs> oh dear. Oh my god, no. Please put in. Okay. That was really weird. And I think that is it. I'm gonna bring up and say my pants is like destroyed from makeup. So I'm gonna bring you guys up closer so you can see the finished results. I feel like my lighting was really awful for that video so i'm sorry but yeah this is the result i'm not okay i'm just gonna do that again i'm not in 
incredible at makeup and I'm not good at it either but I'm not good at makeup and I'm like I just kind of do it because I like to do it and hope to get better at it but this is the look completed um, if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment and subscribe and let me know what you thought of it don't forget to subscribe as well because we're almost on 200 subscribers Woo. and yeah if you do want to see me do any other videos let me know because I'm kind of struggling to come up with videos I just video ideas because I don't know like see I do want to sit down and do talky talky type videos about like maybe advice and stuff but I find those videos um, it's just kind of scary to get my opinions out there and stuff but if you do want to see me do any advice videos or Q&A's if you have any questions you can follow my social medias which will be linked in the description box let me know because I would love to start doing those videos and yeah I hope to see you with another video very soon also please excuse my hair <laughs> bye